All this is going in the podcast. Hope you know that. Boom. <laughs> What's going on, guys? My name is Brock. I'm here with my buddy Tim. And today we have some more barn. Barn. The barn. The barn. We need somebody to sing that for us. Maybe I should get Laura Beth up I'll here. I'll do it. No. Do it. Dude, we don't want. Do we want to freaking annihilate people's ears? Anyway, today we have five topics for you guys to talk, for us to talk about, and you to comment in the to comment down below what you think about the topics. I had a little bit of a mind screw there. Okay, so first topic, Tim. You ready to get you ready to get jumping on this? Let's do it. All right, first topic is the issues that Guild Wars 2 had on release. Now I know you didn't know much about this, but. Well, first of all, Guild Wars 2 sold more than 1 million copies and hit over 400,000 concurrent users. That's in the head start. That was the pre-release. Okay. So it's kind of ridiculous. They're doing really, really well with that sales. That is really well. But they had tons of issues, almost as many issues as Di uh, Diablo 3 and other MMOs that start out with their servers. Um, their ser people are like getting disconnected all the time. Well, I mean, I'm sure they didn't expect the show out that they had. I know, but they should have because their servers were crashing yeah. in the beta. Right, okay. so, they, so yeah. they should like they should have expected a big freaking pile. Plus, they they're getting money from sales. So they should know how many people are buying the damn game. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, they said they made a Reddit page with all the things they're going to be working on. So I think that's pretty cool. At least they're um, being like proactive with it. Oh yeah. Now speaking of Reddit, uh, just the other day, President the President Barack Obama didn't ask me anything on Reddit, and it was actually him. Did you hear about that? No. He didn't ask me anything on Reddit, and then it was just nuts, like, how many responses he got. And to ask me anything, in case you don't know what that is, is basically just people make posts, and they're like, ask me any questions you want, that sort of thing. And, um, yeah, I got a ridiculous amount of responses. Sorry about those dogs, freaking bastards. Hold on one second. Shut it, you twats. God. Okay, anyway, so Barack Obama did that, and I thought that was pretty cool. I was connecting with us through the internet, that sort of thing. So it was a little side topic that didn't count. Shh. It didn't count. Barack Obama. Barack Obama. Ha 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 ha. Uh. Oh, la 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 la. <laughs> okay, moving on to our next topic. GameStop is now considering selling vintage games, like N64 games and stuff, on their website. Yeah, now they no, they're not going to be in stock anymore, like they used to be for like 25 cents, which was the bomb. And I miss yeah. that so much. But um, I no, can sell all my games to them. I'm sure. Yeah, but uh, they'll be selling those in their website. And they said we think there's a vintage sales opportunity, so we're accumulating some inventory. So that's pretty cool. I thought you might enjoy that. I know I'm gonna enjoy that because I might pick some stuff up. I wonder if they're gonna no. sell consoles though. That'll be my question. You don't um, have a console. I don't have an N64 now. I uh, used to an N64 and two Super Nintendos. You do? Yep. Damn. Literally, I think if I get an N64, the only game I'll play is Pokemon Snap, and that'll pretty much oh be it. Oh my god. <laughs> I love that Most game so much. Game, but it's so, much it's so fun. <laughs> it's like, look at the little Pokemon. <laughs> Snap. And you get one of the rare Pokemon, you just like piss yourself. Yeah. God, that's the best. Okay, moving on to our next uh, kind of racist topic. Uh, Blizzard. Oh, jeez. Well, people took it as racist. It's not actually racist, but Blizzard, the company, you know, that makes everything. World of Warcraft, Diablo, all that. Just recently cut off their Battle.net access in Iran. <laughs> and they have they have this long explanation about how they can't connect well and then our the product is being embargoed goods and all this stuff, but it's really just, it's just racist. So screw you guys. I'm just kidding. You're not racist. But that's a really dumb that's a really dumb reason to do that, if you ask me. I don't know. What do you think, Tim? You think that's real or bullshit? That's racism. Yeah, I gotta say I gotta say it's pretty racist. I mean plus Iran, like of all countries to cut off, you're gonna cut off Iran. Especially in the time that's going on right now. <laughs> Everybody's gonna think you're freaking racist. If you guys just heard that Skype message, I apologize. Moving on. I don't think you should have because we're just recording mumble, aren't we? Um, next topic. Now, I know you've never played this game, Tim. But, uh, Supergiant Games, the uh, Bastion, which is the my, one of my favorite games of all time, uh, is soon to be released on the iPad. 
for five dollars. I don't know how they're gonna manage that. I'm kind of interested in it though, so I might uh, go to my friend's house and buy it and pick up. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I want to try it though. I think that'd be kind of interesting. Yeah. But uh, it's probably one of the best storylines I've ever played in a game because it's done by Warner Brothers, so clearly it's gonna be free. Next amazing. to Mario. Mario. No, Mario's storyline's awful. I love Mario. Hey. Storyline's terrible though. Hey. I'm gonna get hates for that, but you know. You know what? Hey. Bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Hey. <laughs> Alright, so are we ready for our last topic? Our last topic is going to be deemed as the what the fuck story of the day. And that is... What the fuck story of the day? Ba -dum -bum. And that is B.O.B. I'm sure you're familiar with B.O.B. the rapper. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is releasing Strange Clouds the game on the App Store. Now apparently this game is going yeah apparently this game is going to be based on you fly around in space as a two-eyed alien with a hat and studs in his ears and you cut shapes in clouds. Yeah. That's a game that I will not be downloading. I think I'm that actually going to download it. a game that I will not be buying. It. <laughs> I think that it's probably actually going to be really addicting. I got to say it's probably going to be ridiculously Sounds addicting. Stupid. Yeah, it does sound stupid, but you know what? Angry Birds is stupid. That's not. Yeah, it is. That's not. What makes sense in Angry Birds? Nothing. Bird. Flick. Kill people. Kill a freaking pigs, you mean? That's what I said. No, you said people. Why you lie? I ain't mean, even people. You're people. I mean, I anyway, those are our topics for the day. Links down to those topics in the description. And uh, you got anything else to say, Tim? Before we, before we head out? Bye. Bye. Yeah. Anyway, tune in next time. We don't have a defined time for when we'll be releasing these yet, but we will be... Right. We will be releasing these, so stay tuned. Subscribe, leave a like, go subscribe to Tim, and we'll see ya. Bye. Bye-bye. Oh,